Hey guys, it's me Lunar. Welcome back to another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. In this one, I'll be showing you guys how to find the rare secret weapon, the Ornate Dagger or Vampire Knife. It was mentioned a lot in my Missable Collectible video. I missed covering this weapon, so I am showing it to you now and it's really easy to get, although it is missable. If the video is helpful, a like is very much appreciated. As always, we get straight to the point. To get this dagger, you will need to first find some secret messages hidden around Saint Denis. After which you'll be given a map to a treasure location, you go to the location for a cutscene and you will receive the dagger. Super easy and simple if you know where to go. The first location we're going to is at the bottom of Saint Denis beside the railway tracks. An old building sits here and the writing is on the wall just through one of these gates. From here, head north a little bit to the entrance to the Saint Denis Market. The writing is on a wall just behind the small gate area to the right of the entrance. Next head to this group of buildings and head into the alleyways under the electrical work sign. On the left down the steps is the writing on the wall. It's a damn fine day. From here on the same block of buildings, head up the street to the Jade Dragon Chinese restaurant. Head in the alleyway to find the writing on the wall on the right hand side. Our final writing is on the street here, just below the saloon. It's just written on the wall, you can see it easily from the street. Now you should have all five pieces of text, they form a location as to where to get the weapon from. To get this we need to head to the spot on the map I have marked it here at midnight. Now there are some people having problems with this and it is missable so here is an easy solution. When waiting for midnight, don't wait close to the location of where you need to go, wait at the entrance to the church which is close by. After midnight head to the location and an X should be on your map. If it's not there, simply run around the church again and the X will usually appear. Make sure you make a save just before midnight so that way you can reload your game. But I tested this out and it always seems to work for me, so this should work for you guys. Now when you fight the vampire, make sure to kill him. If you die, he won't appear again and the weapon is missable. Similarly, if you don't pick up the weapon when you're here, it will also disappear, like a lot of the weapons in game like the rare shotgun, so make sure that you do pick it up. Also don't do anything other than kill him, like tie him up for example. I did this to see if he would be killed by sunlight, which he wasn't, but after you tie him up, he no longer uses the dagger to attack, he will simply attack you with his hands. And if you kill him, then the dagger won't appear. So yes, kill him as soon as you can in the alleyway and pick up the ornate dagger straight away. Guys, just a quick one, but the final weapon guide for getting all 59 weapons in game, I've covered all of the ones that you need to find rather than just get from completing the missions. I will be making a complete video on how to get all 59, plus a showcase of all 59 as well, but that video won't be out probably till next week as I'm working on some other videos right now, including how to get all 21 perks. Subscribe with notifications on to see more Red Dead guides, and of course all the Red Dead online updates as we get them. Enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.